Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. My name is Shaki and today I have a very, very big announcement. I've actually already announced this online already on Instagram and Twitter, but I thought I would come on and announce it to you guys as well, just in case you guys would like to join in as well. So a lot of you know that uh, recently I co-hosted The Simsathon and I also used to co-host something called Room With Seasons, which was a seasonal 24 hour readathon. I'm not sure if it's still going on, obviously because I'm not a host anymore, but I used to co-host that and I have co-hosted Simsathon literally this past month. And I just missed running my own readathon. I did a lot of running behind the scenes of Ruin Seasons, so I missed doing that and running my own readathon kind of thing. Um, so I decided to make another one because apparently I hate myself. So I was thinking about what readathon I personally would like to make and what personally I would like to participate in, and I was thinking, and I actually couldn't find one or think of one that was meshing films and movies together, two of my biggest passions. Thus birthed the Filmathon. I do think there's already something called the Filmathon, which to my dismay, they will have to have the name if they choose to like come for me. But they haven't been active in a while and I just, I didn't know that they had the name until after I started and setting up the Instagram and stuff, which is my bad. Um, but if they want the name, they can have it. So the name might change, but for now, we are calling it the Filmathon. So the Filmathon is basically a week long readathon, which is going to be in various months of next year, which I will tell you about in just a second. But for basics, as for right now, the Filmathon is a week readathon dedicated to reading. With this readathon there are no rules, there are no regulations, no one's going to come after you and police your readathon. Although there are advice prompts if you do want to participate in them and read along with us all. The prompts are based off of films and for the first round I decided to base the film prompts off of classic movies. So those prompts will be coming very soon, closer to the readathon. I think in December they'll be coming, um, but they aren't mandatory to the readathon at all. With said advised prompts, you can win some things called cinema tickets, which I have to give credit where credit is due here because Cara over at Bianca Reads has an amazing, obviously, readathon called the Simsathon that I've already mentioned, where we have to read for points. And I really, really like the effort of that readathon and decided to apply it to my own and see how I could make it from and so the idea of cinema tickets came about. In this readathon, you can gain cinema tickets by doing so, so, so much. Actually completing the prompts will gain you some cinema tickets, like in the Simsathon, they are points, but with this one, it is cinema tickets. They're obviously not real cinema tickets, they're just what I've called the points. Each of the prompts have their own cinema tickets allocated to them, depending on how um, hard they are to find and to complete. So that all will be coming in my announcement slash TBR video in December. You can also gain cinema tickets by a participating in reading sprints over on the Filmathon Instagram and Twitter pages. So the Twitter and Instagram page will be linked down below, but they are exactly the same. It's underscore Filmathon, all one word, no caps, just film a thon. You can also gain cinema tickets by posting in our hashtag, hashtag Filmathon, participating in live reading sprints on Instagram Live as well. Once the round's over, you can email your total amount of cinema tickets to Filmathon, readathon at gmail.com, and the person who has the most, who has emailed me, who has the most, will get the grand prize are reading the most or collecting the most of my tickets in the round. But again, this side of the readathon is optional. It's quite tempting because of the prizes. Um, the prizes won't be anything special because I'm not rich. I am doing this and funding this all by myself. So I'll be giving away some books that I own currently and also maybe buying some here and there for people who win giveaways, etc. on Instagram and Twitter, all that good stuff. Our group movie to watch for each round is also optional. That will also be announced in my TBR announced video coming in December as well. So watch out for that but it is optional, you do not have to participate. The first round of the Filmathon will be happening from the 7th to the 14th of January 2020, so why not start off your reading year and get ahead of your Goodreads goals with a huge bat at the start of this year. I'm always looking for ways in order to improve my readathons and, you know, improve my skills as a co-host or a host on my own. So drop me an email if you have any feedback or anything or even a DM on Twitter, I'm really casual about it because I really would like this readathon to reach as many people as possible and people to enjoy their time reading as much as possible as well. I also in the future may be looking for co-hosts who are just as enthusiastic about books and movies and hosting a readathon as me. So if you are interested, also give me a DM as well or an email. We will see what happens in the future with co-hosts. Thank you so much for watching this announcement video. I really hope that you enjoyed it and will be considering coming and joining us read some books for the Filmathon. The first round, again, 
will be from the 7th to the 14th of January 2020, the second week of January, I believe. So you have a week of free reading of the year and then we're doing some film if shits. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you when my announced video slash TBR slash group movie video comes out in December. Bye!